Hi viewers, welcome to our Amma YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to say about singular and plural. I gonna give you some tips to change some words from singular into plural. First one, it is general. If we find a singular noun, mean we can just add S with the singular noun. Then the singular noun should become a plural. For example, boy in singular, boys in plural, car, cars, chair, chairs. So like this, we can change the singular noun into plural. Whereas in another case, if the singular noun end with the yes, or sh or ch or o or x for in such a kind of cases we have to remove the s sh ch o and x and instead of these we have to add es with the singular noun if we do this then the singular noun will become a plural one for example bus in this case the singular noun bus ends with a s so we have to remove the yes and add es according to the rules what i have said earlier then bush bushes match matches hero heroes box boxes these are some kinds of examples but there are some exceptionals also there for example photo the word singular noun photo ends with O, but we could not add ES with this photo while we change the photo into plural. Because these are some exceptional words. How do we change this? Just add yes only. It's enough. For example, photo in singular, photos in plural. Just add yes only. Then piano, pianos, radio, radios, studio, studios. So these are some exceptional words in these rules. Then we move on to next one. In such a case, a singular noun ends with the letter Y. If we find any singular noun ends with the letter Y and also the Y preceded by consonant. Uh, before the Y letter, we have to find any consonant letter or consonant sound mean. Uh, we can change the singular noun like this. For example, we have to remove the Y and instead of Y, we have to add I, E, S. For example, in singular noun baby, in plural, instead of Y, we have to add I, E, S. Baby, babies. City, cities. Lady, ladies. Copy, copies. Reply, replies. Story, stories. So, these are some kind of uh, singular into plural changing formation. And now we move on to next one. If we find any singular noun end with Y and also the Y preceded by vowel sound A, E, I, O, U mean, we need not to add I, E, S instead of Y. Just remove the Y and add S. It's only enough. For example, day. Here, the Y preceded by vowel sound A. So, here we just add yes, it's enough. Day in singular, days in plural. Donkey, donkeys, monkey, monkeys, boy, boys, guy, guys. Story, stories, SA, SAs. Like this you can add more and more. And we move on to another one case. If you find any singular noun end with F or FE mean, then we have to remove the F and FE. Then additionally we have to add VES in plural noun. For example, OFF in singular noun. Instead of F, we have to add VES. OFF in singular, OFFS in plural. WIFE, WIFES. WOLF, WOLFS. KNIFE, KNIFES. Grief, griefs, shelf, shelves, thief, thieves, belief, beliefs. Like that you can add more and more. In another one case, if you find any singular nouns, we can how to change the form and also other spelling, then it will become a plural one. For example, child in singular, we have to change it from spelling and the formation of word, children, then it will become a plural one. Man, men. 
tooth, teeth, foot, feet, ox, axle, woman, woman, loose, lice, mouse, mice, goose, geese. These are some kinds of example in this case. Then, always some nouns are same in singular and plural. We could not uh, call it in singular or we could not call it uh, as a plural. For example, deer. In singular also deer. In plural also it is called a deer. Sheep, cattle, furniture, police. These are always in singular, always in plural. There is no, no particular form for these words. How can we use these words in a sentence? For example, deer. There are deers in the forest. It is actually wrong. We can use it. There are deer in the forest. It's right one. Then we move on to another one case. Some nouns, uh, singular nouns end with yes, but uh, it always in singular form. It is not in plural form. In first rule we have seen, just add yes with a singular noun, then it will become a plural one, isn't it? But here some nouns are end with yes, but it is not a plural, it is always in singular. For example, mechanics, news, innings, economics, physics, politics, these are always in singular noun only. For example, how can we use these words in a sentence? Economics are one of her subject. This is wrong. Economics is one of her subject. This is right. What are the latest news? This is wrong. What is the latest news? This is right. Then we move on to the next one. Some nouns always in plural. There is no similar form for it. For example, scissors, spectacles, trousers, pants, jeans, tights, pajamas, bell bottoms, binoculars, shorts, knickers, nail clips. These are always in plural form. There is no similar form for it. How can we use it in a sentence? Your trouser is torn. This is a wrong form. Your trousers are torn because these nouns are always in plural. Then, if we find the singular noun in a compound noun form, in, we have to use yes with the second word. For example, stepmother. We have to add yes with the second word mother. In plural, stepmothers, boyfriend, boyfriends, school book, school books, news reader, news readers. Like this you can do. If you find any compound noun made with the preposition mean, we have to add yes with the first word. For example, mother-in-law, mothers-in-law, son-in-law, sons-in-law. And we move on to next one. If you find any abbreviation in noun area, I mean, we have to add S with the abbreviation also. For example, MLA, MLAs, MP, MPs, VIP, VIPs. I think you can understand. Next, we move on to next one. Sometimes, we change the singular noun into plural, while the meaning of the word should become also changed. For example, cloth in singular, it indicate the material cloth. For but if we change the singular into cloths, plural, it indicates the kinds of material or kinds of cloth. I will give you more example. Goat, goats, it's a material. Manner, manners. Spectacle, spectacles. So, I hope it should be a useful one. one if you like our video, I mean you just hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to hit like button. Thank you. Meet you again.